Good evening and welcome to another caravan video and in this video I'll be giving you an update at Thornwick Bay So caravan's all set up at Thornwick Bay and there's nothing new, everything's fine, not to do any repairs. Uh, got an extra table in the awning and I've got this uh, tarpaulin to go on the grass here you know, to stop stop any water ingress because we had a problem with that with water getting it to come up through through the carpet, you know this uh, this carpet wasn't nice when it rained, but we not had any rain, but shouldn't be a problem. And I've got, got new new windbreaks, some cheap ones from Argos. Anyway, the real point of this video is to show you uh, the changes here at Thornwick Bay since I made the last video here. Not last made video here. And one major change, well since I was last here anyway, is some of these touring pictures have been taken up and it's been replaced by storage made a store, storage yard and some static caravans and some steps and a few high bins store cable but I think this all relates to one major change that's happened on this site and we did see the beginnings of that major change last year so I'll take you down near the entrance and we'll uh, I can show you what what's going on so something going on here it's a new construction not sure what it is probably a reception of some some sort I've got a few statics for sale I'll just quickly go around, I'm not going to go inside them like I did on a previous video. So we have this one. £28,000 excluding in site fees and running costs. Looks like a brand new one. And the Willoughby Seasons for just over 32000 It's like a new ABI because Coworth exclusive 30,000. Oh, this looks nicer, and that's reflected in the price. I'll just dip in here. And Swift Fendi Lodge, seventy thousand. <coughs> they don't come cheap, these statics. And will be Shearton's just over sixty-eight thousand. <coughs> Last and certainly not least, 2021 ABI Ambleside Premier, six, nearly 66,000. So that concludes this uh, little tour of the uh, statics they have for sale. So the one big change made to this site is this. So this is within the last 12 months they made all these new static pictures and you see why it's called the lake so you can see a lake so what I'll do is I'll uh, set you up on the mount set up on the mount and we'll take a drive round and we'll have a closer look so now you're set up in the car we'll go for a drive and we'll have a look around Um, 
which you can see and I think it's, it seems to be still under construction some uh, new pictures for Take a look around here. Maybe some more oh, pictures. Look at all these speed bumps. Look at these speed hills. As you can see, there's a lot. There's a lot of em empty pictures down here. See where this, this takes us. I might have to turn round. Yes, we're at, we're at a dead end. So I'll just turn around here. I'm not sure how many pictures, but I guess by number of vans, that's all. Is there must be at least 50 new pictures? Probably more than that. Occupied, but over look up, so there's an undeveloped side of things. And I'm not sure if there's maybe some more pictures going on here because the land's been cleared. And there's some construction work going on. They're going to add a fair bit to the site. Turn around here, and um, I don't know if you can see the lake. It's a nice little lake there. So I think that's the end of these, uh, the tour of this particular part of the site the new statics so what I'll do is go back to my, my caravan and see if there's anything else I can show that's new and if not I might have to end the video here so that is it for this video so I've showed you what's new at Thalmick Bay Hope you enjoyed this video. Please remember to like, subscribe, share, ring that notification bell, and you get notified when one of my videos comes out. Questions and comments, you know where to put them. As ever, thanks for watching, and I'll see you there.